Hey, welcome back. It's uh, Brad Taylor at Taylor Coach and Tracy's RV Center in Millgrove, Ontario, Canada. We're back to uh, show you one of our another unit uh, that we have been producing for the last few years. This is a 15 foot uh, mid bath, and it's also a few things that are different than this. That it's got a little bigger bath than that we've done on some of the other ones, but not as large as some of the big ones. And it's also a little wider, which means this particular coach is uh, seven feet wide versus six and a half feet wide. So when it comes to the front window, it's giving you a bigger front window with lots more visibility for seeing out the front of that. Um, you know, so you can see around the park for what's going on and make your decisions on what you're doing during the daytime there when you're making your decisions, what you're heading out to do. Still got your double double twenties on the front, your battery. Um, we have the BAL jacks on the back. It has the uh, A and E rollout awning on the side, so it's a little bigger awning on the side. It's now a ten foot awning on the side. You have the porch light. Um, we have our spare tire still mounted on there. Um, this particular coach here. Uh, being it's seven feet wide also gives you a lot more, I should say a lot more, but gives you some more aisle space on the inside. Um, let's take you on board and we'll show you some of the features on the inside here. Now we got you on board this particular trailer here. A few things I want to make note to you too. Remember it's our, it's our rear door in this 15. We do have some side doors that we're offering in 12s and 14s also for 2013 coming up in next year's models. Um, that you can also watch for. Um, but saying all that, this particular coach being at seven feet wide and all the features with the bigger bath, bigger holding tanks, and that that he has all on this particular coach. Um, when we put it on our scales, because we digitally weigh everything that we built, so we ac were accurate in our weights. This particular coach came in at uh, 1,872 pounds sitting on the scales with all this great space inside. To show you some of the great features on the inside here, to start with is this bath here. So you can see it protrudes out a little bit more. So we've got a bigger bath in it here. So we've moved our shower pan over, giving you more elbow space inside the bathroom. We've got our, our nice vanity in the bathroom, along with a nice medicine cabinet that we produce ourselves. You've got your mirror in here as well, giving you a little bit more shoulder space on the upper part of your body. Which, you know, when people are saying, hey Brad, we don't want a large bath in it where we've got a separate tub, toilet, and all that. It's giving you more space with the vanity for brushing your teeth, your medicine cabinet, for all your toiletries and stuff like that. And underneath the sink area here, we've got extra storage for your blankets and things like that <clears throat> stored underneath. Which makes it really nice that it's still not a real big trailer when it comes to the towing aspect. Um, from there on the counter is very very similar to a lot of our 14s. Um, you've got your microwave up above, your two burner cooktop, uh, a 2.7 in the in the fridge for for the fridge here. It's a two way, so it's propane, gas, electric. Lots of storage underneath, a cutlery tray as well, um, a single sink. Um, coming around to the front here. Um, this particular one, instead of the double dinettes that you've seen in a lot of the units that we've been showing, this is a gaucho up at the front here, so we have a couch, which gives you a little bit more floor space up at the front here. This also makes into the same bed. We offer this same couch setup. You can get them in the 14s, uh, the 15s. Um, this particular couple that we built this trailer for, they did not want the double dinette like you see in some of our 14s, but you can also get the couch in the 14s also. Um, this pulls into the same size bed. Now you don't have the ledge at the front up here, so when you want to put this into the bed, you grab your cushions, slide it ahead, swings right out. Being that this is 7 foot wide, this coach, now we've got a 54 by 81 long bed. So for for couples that are out there that are saying, you know, we need a little longer bed than the 75 inches, we do offer different widths in the trailers. This is nice and easy to put up and down. Um, you know, when we bump this trailer out to that 7 foot wide, it's giving you that longer bed, 81, it's still 54. Um, 
So for ones you're uh, looking for that kind of stuff, it is also available in the Taylor coaches. And it's giving you the floor space. When this is pulled out to a bed, it does give you all the storage underneath for putting baskets and stuff like that. It's because your bed's coming right out. You've got all your storage underneath. Um, from there, you've got the little single dinette again here <coughs> that uh, a lot of couples really like in our trailers that when we, we can pull out our bed here, we can leave it to a bed all the time. And then from there, We've got a little dinette to sit and grab a bite to eat at, and we don't have to make our bed up and down all the time. And this also makes into a nice single bed also. If you want to put it into a single bed, you can also put it down and put your pillows at the back, and it also looks like another couch in it if you wanted. You still have the bunk up above here for your storage of your blankets and pillows and that. We just have our pins at the end, like I've showed in lots of our other videos, that the bunk just swings down. So you have the option that you have your bunk up above, your 54 below, and another single over here. Has the multimedia player built right all in it too, so that if they, for, for listening to the music, and eventually if they ever want to add TV or anything like that, it's a CD, DVD player, and that's all, that's an option to them too. Got our camera guy to swing past me here. Um, and being on the 15 too, where it's added a little bit more into this particular trailer, it's added a lot bigger closet into the back here. So we've got a couple extra shelves with a rod up above. Um, and that's keeping the bed at the front there an even 54 that we haven't staggered it at all or anything like that. And, uh, you know, it's some of the features. It all depends on what you're looking for in a trailer. Um, so I really hope you enjoyed the, the video on this particular 15. If you've got any questions on them or anything like that, don't hesitate to give us a call. Again, my name's Brad Taylor at uh, Taylor Coach and Tracy's RV. Um, when you go to our website, you can find our phone number and our email address to get if you've got any questions on it. And uh, look forward to, to chatting with you guys out there. And uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Take care. We'll talk to you soon. Bye now.